Imagine I broke the speed limit. Imagine I was driving down the street and I was flying past the car, zooming in and out, weaving about, not caring about them at all. Why? Because it's fun. <laughs> because why would I care about other people? Now, imagine I was spotted by a police car and the police were flashing their lights trying to get me to stop and I refused because why do I have to listen to them? Why should they have to tell me what to do? Imagine I get caught by the police, they block me in and I'm trapped. The policeman gets out of the car, tells me to stop and I refuse. Why? Because who's he to tell me what to do? I live my life, I make my decisions, thank you very much. So why is he in charge of me? Who's he to tell me what to do? Now, if I were to actually do those things, what would you think of me? If I were to actually do those things, if I were to actually act in that way, I wouldn't have respect for anything. I would bring trouble and danger is what I would do. If I didn't respect the law, then anything goes. If I didn't respect the passengers, the, the pedestrians, the drivers around me, then I'm putting them in danger by my actions. If I don't respect the police and people who have authority over me, then I'm foolishly gonna get myself in trouble. In those scenarios, respect should be the thing that's driving my actions, but it wasn't. What was the thing that was driving me? It was wanting to do what I want. It wasn't having any care for other people, for the law, for the rules, for what I'm meant to do, for what is right. All I'm caring about is me and what I want. Does any of that describe you? When there's a, a rule you should follow, when there are people around you just living their lives, when there are people with authority guiding you, telling you what to do, how do you respond? What do you do? What is the thing that's driving you? Let's say you are like a car. Your life is a car. Your body is a vehicle and you do things. What is it driving you? What is it that's motivating you? It's either one of two things. It's either a respect for others or it's just a care for yourself and no one else. One of those two things is driving you right now. Which one is it? Is it a care and respect for the things that deserve your respect? Or do you disregard others because you're just caring about you? Look, surely if you were created by God and he purposefully made you, then that gives you so much worth and value, right? But that statement is true of the person sitting next to you. That statement is true of the kid in the class that you hate. That statement is true of your teacher. If God has made each one of us on purpose, that gives us so much value, so much worth. So if each one of us has been created on purpose with value and worth, then the question is, are you gonna give people the respect that you believe they owe you? I'm gonna ask that again, because I think it's important. Are you gonna give the respect to other people that you believe you deserve from them? Because so much of the time we can only think of us, we can want people to treat us well while we just treat them like poop. And the moment someone disrespects us, poof, we fly off the handle and we hate it. Is that you? Or does that not describe you? Is it better to describe you as someone who gives people the respect they deserve, no matter who they are, no matter what they're like, no matter what they've done, you give them that respect because they deserve it. Because they've been created with a worth and a value just as you have. So my last question for you is this. I want you to think, okay, 
think of the people or person in your life who you admire the most. Now, I'm not saying the people who you have fun with the most, the people who you can mess around with and be crazy, your best mates. I'm not thinking about them. Think about the people you admire the most, who you genuinely look up to the most. All right? You got them in your mind? I guarantee that those people are the kind of people who show respect and show care to everyone around them, no matter who they are, no matter what they've done, even if they don't really deserve it because of how they act, because of what they're like. Am I wrong? Tell me you're wrong. You can't, because I'm right. The people who we admire the most, they respect people. They have this deep, genuine care for everyone around them, no matter what. Why would you not be like that? The people we love the most, the people we look up to the most, have this respect. Why would you and I not want that ourselves? What is stopping us from being like that? We could be the people who we think are the best. We have the power to do that, don't we? What are you going to do? What are you cho going to choose to do? What is it in your life that is driving you? Is it just care for yourself? Or is it a respect for other people?